Set up all around. <laughs> Reset. <laughs> Jesus, I've only started, Chibi. Fucking hell, you're hard to please. If I miss bomb, I reset. That's the rule. Goombas were not having any crack. Reset! I'm resetting. How are you getting on today, boss? I'm very hungover. You doing the charity tourney today? Oh, I'm doing it, and yes, I am too hungover. I was actually so sad uh, after playing the other one a couple of days ago. I got I went like two and one and I seen PT got top twenty four. I was disgusted. Because I was bodying PT in Valhalla. So how the hell did he make top twenty four? Has he just been on a mad come up since then? I don't know how the hell he did it. Because I was literally slapping him around at Valhalla and Friendies. I mean, he's decent, but Jesus, getting top 24, I was like, what the fuck? Fair play to him. I thought he wasn't good against Floaties, considering I 2 0 him like two weeks prior. Then he 2 0 Lorister. I know that name. Why do I know that name? Is Lorister like a peach or some shit? Here we go. Current best peach in the UK. That's wild. What the hell is PT being up to? That's nuts. I thought the person he practiced with the most was Winja, who's fucking a Captain Falcon. 17th on the PR, but heavily underrated because low attendance. Fucking hell. Go on, PT. Peach can be a serious pain in the arse if you don't know how to play her. He defo knows the matchup. I wonder who he plays with. Gibby! How are you, young fella? What's the crack? Whew. 
I don't know how he did it. Just get game to like 20% repeatedly. <laughs> Facts. Lorister's Mr. Edgeguard. Ugh. He's basically a peach version of Marth. Gimpy Gimpy. Oh, I got this set up all wrong. Shit. <gasps> Don't fall! Oh my god, safe. Man, I was so salty when I lost to that guy, Rory X. I did not think he was good at all. It's just... You know, it, you probably don't understand Chipster, but you can probably see where I'm coming from. Like, the fact that Ireland's such a small scene, I kind of... I know the player Marth matchup over here, rather than, like, actual playing against Marths. So when I played him, I was like not expecting certain things, and it just screwed me over so badly. Ah, I was salty as fuck. I did not think he was good at all. Well, not not trashing him, but like, I definitely think I should, I could have and should have beaten him. I played like ass. I did pretty okay against Lavingi in game one, and then game two he kind of turned on the Lavingi. Yeah, exactly. And that's something Mint has been saying to me for the longest time. I need to stop playing the player matchup and learn to play the character. And I kind of for a while I didn't understand what he meant. Because I was doing okay at a, a broad events, but now it's kind of looking way more obvious. Like with isolation and only playing net play, it's really glaring even to me that like I'm playing the player, not the matchup. So I need to stop that. I use Anthers a lot, so I get a large amount of different player exposure. That is a shout, but isn't Anthers cancer? From what I hear, anyway. Also, the UK Discord is pretty cancer as well. From my own, like, two experiences, the people I've, like, played with are just fucking arseholes. What is... Here we go. Cancer on Anthers is mad overrated. You get very few people there being toxic. I might give it a look then. Most people are chill. They say, oh, GG's and get on with their day. Well, if that's coming from a Jigglypuff main, then it mustn't be as bad as it used to be. Because I remember, like, I know Chris gets mad abuse on Anthers. Just because he's so fucking good. No, you fucking idiot, Daniel! I've already ruined this. God damn it. Look at the speed of me as well now after that mess up. Oh, you son of a bitch!
Oh no, I've messed this up, haven't I? Nice. Oh no, no, don't! <sighs> At least I didn't die. How can you trash talk, Chris? I know. He's, uh, he's, like, screenshotted messages. He got some really bad ones, like... It's funny seeing toxicity in the melee scene, because... A lot of people get fucking outraged by some of it, but unless you've come from an FPS scene like I did, you do, you're kind of shocked, but, like, coming from Halo, nothing really, like, freaks me out, because it's all homophobic, racist shit, and it's just like... So bad. And it's bad, it's like kind of shitty to say, but it's facts, it's, that's normal in the FPS scene, like, people are just sick. But yeah, it's funny, like, it's weird to me seeing like, how outraged people are about, like, I get it. But seeing that kind of stuff is kind of like, it doesn't really shock me because I've seen it since I was like 15 years old. As I said, not that it's okay at all. It's just, I've seen it a lot. Oh, CS is like that as well. I suppose, yeah, it actually just is FPSs in general. Halo is really bad for it. Getting a consistent base is good. Yeah, I'm bad at this matchup or I'm not good at playing my name. Or just no GG's. So that's fine. That's just like... Oh, <gasps> no! I need to get another star. That's just bog standard salt. Like, that's fine. But like, going off on one is just like, man, shut the fuck up. Like... Someone calling me a retard after a game or just nothing. Honestly, I'm quite thankful. They're so nice. It can get really bad. Like, really, really evil. It's funny because... I've been playing a lot of Rocket League. And it's a big thing in Rocket League. Like, people are toxic as fuck. And... I've been out of that, like, type of game that causes toxicity for such a long time. Like, I haven't played competitive Halo in years, so... While I'm accustomed to all the abuse and, like, slurs, I haven't experienced it in ages. But Jesus, Rocket League just makes me so mad, because after, like, two minutes in the game... Your team, like someone on your team is blaming their teammates or like singling out someone for being shit and it's just like please fuck off I came in here to try and play not to see abuse or be abused and it's not like the match is even over yet it's just some fucking whinge bag taking everything out on his teammates at least Ireland is pretty sound anyways mainly handled Oh yeah, we all, we all preach it, like, we've pretty much got the soundest scene. Like, I could, I could, like, just go for points with anybody in the Irish melee scene. I don't know if they think the same way around, because, like, I'm very loud, but... That's to their own. I can say, personally, that I pretty much like everyone in our scene. Which is pretty cool. Holy shit, I, I'm actually after bringing this run back somehow. Yes! To me, when I first came into the melee scene, how not toxic everything is.
camera. Damn, I tried to heat check that. Oh, it really is shaped through. Like, it's strange as fuck for me. Like, like if someone just destroys you, like, someone like Chris, who just bashes people on the regular, like, he's really humble and helpful. I remember firsthand, like, being good at an FPS. I used to just shit talk everyone. I was just like, stop playing this game. You're wasting my time. And when I played Chris for the first couple of times, I was just like, why is he helping me? And why is he being nice? Like, it just felt weird. <laughs> just really funny. Like, it's something I'm trying, I'm still trying to learn because I still have that massive ego inside me from being an FPS player. Like, I just want to shit talk everybody I beat and just kind of look down on them. But that's kind of not the way you're supposed to be in the melee community. I know that tag. I think he's been in the Irish uh, Discord a few times. Yes. So thank because of like I found a one in a million human. I swear, yeah, somebody who's actually a sound. Then I found out everyone's like this. It's nuts. It's such a weird scene. And as well, there's a lot of like, well, younger than me, like mid twenties, early twenties people who are all just sound as chips. The teenagers can be a bit toxic, but that's understandable. But like, it, when I was playing Halo, it was literally everybody, every single player of all ages was a fucking asshole. So it's weird, it's especially weird for me seeing like, yeah, literally everyone is sound out. This is the run. Holy shit. This has come out of nowhere. Oh my lord. It. 
No. that come from? Yes! Sub-19 out of fucking nowhere! Oh my god, I'm actually shaking so hard. What the fuck? Where did that come from? Oh my fucking god. <laughs> 